Today, we'll be showing you some unbelievable instances where these racist cops put up a fight against kids. Let's get into it. The Volusia County Sheriff's Office has decided to release a body camera video capturing a recent arrest incident after receiving online criticism. According to the investigators, the sergeant in question was responding to a burglary call, but he made an error and stopped one street over from the correct address. Hey, stop the f car. Stop. Can you stay here? No. What are you doing here? Turn the car off. Turn the car off now. Turn the car off now. Turn the car off. Turn the car off now. Turn the car off. Hey, watch what you're doing without punch on your Don't ever forget that I'll punch your damn ass on the hole. Hey, let me explain. No, let me explain to you what we're doing. Put your hands on me and I don't say I'm responding to your alarm call. Put your hands on me and I didn't turn up on you. Turn around. Watch your ass on my mama. Nobody's under arrest. Well, turn the, turn around, ma'am. Turn around. Stop you're not under, me. you're not under arrest. I don't arrest. care. You came in this hostile. Don't you ever put your hands on me. I'll spit on you. Stop you're not under you. arrest. Stop. 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 And put your hands behind your back. Get down. I don't care. Get down. What the f? Get down. Move in the car. Move it. Stop pushing it to the ground. Move. Okay, baby, just here. Put your hands behind your back. Now. Turn the hand behind your back. What the f? Move. Look, baby, just here. Oh my soul. If you don't stop, what's going to happen? Put your other hand on your back. Despite being in the wrong location, the sergeant believed that he arrived at the correct address. What followed next in his encounter was a rapid escalation of events as the sergeant approached to talk to the driver named Liana Rollins, who's 18 years old. You don't stop moving. Stop! I'm trying not to. I'm trying not to you. I'm trying not to hurt you. I am trying not to hurt you. Sit down. I said sit down. Sit down. I am. Get out my face. Do not. Stop. Stop touching me. Stop touching me. Stop touching me. Stop touching me. I said stop touching me. Forty cents for anyone else coming? He has my arm twisted in his handcuff, and I swear to God, if I get out of this, I'm gonna fight. I swear to God. I'm gonna beat the white out of this. Oh my mama. Just chill, bro. Just chill, bro. Bro, take the off now. No. Relax. Hey, baby, just chill. My just twisted. You're gonna chill out. Stop touching me and fix the cup. Fix the cup. This is for the wig. I'm off your kids. Stop. You're gonna wait. I'm mad. You okay. This didn't have to be Stop like that. Stop touching me. It did, because you were aggressive for no reason. All right. You, you know you're wrong, and then I take your whole job. Oh my soul. This my wrist is breaking. What the? It's not breaking. If I said it hurt, it hurt, and I will spit on you. Fix my wrist. What the? This is wrong. What are you doing? Stop touching me. Stop pulling Stop away. Stop touching me. My wrist hurts. I'm going to pull away. What the Why are you doing too much, bro? You, you touch me. I'm going to take your too Don't much. touch me. What's wrong with you? You're sitting down here. The Check You cup. can't say to me. Fix my up. I will. You were just for a second, okay? Fix my cup. Turn around. Now. I asked way too many okay. times. I will. So just turn Fix around and relax. Based on the details outlined in the arrest report, it is stated that Liana tried to physically harm the deputies by striking them in the head. However, this incident has sparked debate and raised questions regarding the sergeant's approach to the car, saying that it was overly aggressive. No, what the f are you doing? I gotta do your job. Stop pressing on me because I'm not resisting. Okay. My wrist already I'm Okay, okay. I'm, I'm trying to put on new ones. So relax. Don't people. The f I'm gonna get these. Bro, hold on. I'm finna lose my f***ing mind. Okay. Take it in the 
Why the f? Why the f? Well, you keep freaking moving around, so. I don't so. know what the f what you talking about. Take okay. Take it off my wrist now. Another deputy's body camera video provides a clear view of the arrest scene. However, there is no footage of Liana actually hitting the officers. Rollins was subsequently arrested and charged with battery on a law enforcement officer. Moving on, we have body camera footage that provides us a glimpse into the chaotic moments surrounding a brawl that broke out on June 12th during a Little League basketball game in Massachusetts. So you're, you're just watching your son play? Yeah. Okay. I'm trying to figure out who was the coach, who was who was like a league president, who was just I, I watching. Head coach of the okay. Yeah, I saw it up. I All saw right. It up. I'll, I'll talk to you if you don't mind. Yep. Hang tight. But everyone else is not been spoken to. So anyway, so you're watching, watching the game. Whenever it gets over, good game. Uh, get mouthy at the end. Uh, they're doing the handshake. Umpires took off. I actually told the umpires, being an umpire, I said, "Hey, watch your back." They left. Uh, something happened. I'm guessing. I'm on the short team. I'm guessing one of the kids said something because the kid might have said something. Is from the from the short side. side. Yeah. Okay. That's what something happened. The other team saying that there's a kid. Is it this history? Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah these two teams have history. Perfect. Something happened where the team from Gary, the other team, threw the glove at that kid's face. And then I kind of went in and put everybody back in the dugout because it was already kind of split up. From the sword side, the being sword like, side, hey, just, I'll just, just let it go. Separate. Yeah, Coach Kelly was dealing with the stuff on the field. I that was the guy who just tried walking up on us. Okay. I just kind of got in the middle or whatever. Uh, all the kids started coming. So, uh, again, me and the other coach kind of made contact. I pointed that way, like, take your kids out that way. I'll keep my kids in here. Not even my kids, the Schwartz kids. Get the hell out of here and we'll stay in the field if you go around. We went around, there was some back and forth, two or three kids. Through the fence, like they came out the third base line? They, started, and they, they were going out so by the by the trees, right? Like, get out of there, so coming up behind that blue building. Yep, yeah, 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 that's yeah, what I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, there's a little bit of a, a, a backstory. Um, so, first of all, in one in our intermediate game this year between Gehrig and Schwartz, which yeah. is 13, I'm listening, I just also want yeah, to... Yeah, during the intermediate game, about a month or so ago, between Gehrig and Schwartz, the police had to come. Some of the players and the parents for Garrett were threatening to shoot one of the umpires. They had to cancel that game, and that, that Garrett team folded. Um, a few of their players had an issue with one of my players in fall baseball from this fall. And so the last time we played them... I'm still threatening my son. He's telling him what goes around coming around. Okay, so where's your car? I'm, I'm over here, but he's in a separate right, hold white car over there. Sir... That's your white car, sir? Let's get you into your, your car to get you out of here. Hey, Manny, can we just keep our mouth? I'm not saying anything. People are telling me, to, can you just step in your car? I'm good, I'm good. I just don't, I, I just don't want any more back no. Okay, there's this car. Police can be seen interviewing individuals of the members of the Schwartz Little League team from Kendrick Field. However, just a few moments into the investigation, the situation takes a sharp turn as chaos breaks out on scene. Yeah, I understand there's a back history and yeah. all that, but so, what happened okay. today? So on today, we were supposed to That's what I've been told yep. several times. We're, we're walking through the line, and the kid 
who had started with our pitch before, kind of like shouldered him. And I didn't, I don't know if anything was said, but he shouldered him. And the next thing you know, as our kid walked by, he like, fucking from behind. And all of a sudden we saw commotion and he like threw uh, a glove at him. Who did? The Swartz to a Lou Gehrig or Lou Gehrig to the Swartz? Who hit my kid? Oh, sir, 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 I just want to know who it is, sir. I just, hey, 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 Hey man, relax, relax, relax. What's the problem? There's no problem. There's no who hit my kid. Who hit my kid? Who hit my kid? Who hit my kid? I just want to know who hit. I just. Hey, hey, hey. As events take a turn, a 17-year-old individual who happens to be the brother of a player of the Vernon Hill Park base Low Gehrig team was tased as he rushed onto the field after his 15-year-old brother was struck during the scuffle. Let me explain to you. Let me explain to you. That's that's crazy right there. That, that's crazy. Sir. He takes a 17 year old kid. Sir. I know he, he but he, Hold on. he's only 15. I understand that. Sir. Listen. We that's got the Sir. I understand everyone's upset. The kid, got, the kid got hit, alright? And then that kid, is that your cousin? Then that's my that's, that's my that's my son. Oh, uh, that's your son? I heard something about him being a cousin. Sir, that's my son. I can't even know who hit my. He has to be here. He's not arrested either. And you take my kid too? Sir, what the is that, bro? Sir, you don't arrest the guy that. Everyone's gone now. So the guy that was involved, you didn't see him. You didn't see him. Did you talk to him? I was working on talking to everyone, sir. Did you talk to the guy? Who is it? Everyone's gonna go to court now regarding this. As the teenager collapses to the ground after being tased, his parents rush onto the field and confront the police, shouting in distress. Notably, the teen's whole body is purposefully hidden in the video, making it difficult to tell what he was doing before the cops tased him. You just, you just, you just tasing my son, and he didn't, he didn't have no dangerous weapon. You just tasing my son with no dangerous weapon. Just, he had, he had mental problems. Chase me, God, chase me. I'm talking to you. Chase me. Why you chase me? Go ahead, take it out. Chase me. Can I get her? I want you to chase me just for talking. And mommy, go ahead, chase me. Body cam footage from an alternate angle shows the teen's mother confronting and yelling at the police officers, passionately emphasizing the belief that her son was tased due to his racial background. I'm his mom, he's 17. I need to know what is he on arrest for. We will tell you in a second. Okay? I need to know. All right, we, will t we, gotta, we, gotta, we gotta calm down for a second, okay? For what you guys got is initially is an emergency call because of your son, right? We were trying to handle that, all right? And I understand the emotions were high because you were like, what did my son get involved in? He just went, he went He's never been in trouble. Game. He's never been Raymond, in trouble. I'm not saying, no, no, no. Never no. in school. Saying that's done either. He's never no in school been suspended, be, yeah, never been in a fight, be, nothing. It should be an even thing. The guy left, hit my thumb and left. You should get let go of my kid right now, too. That's why, that's why, oh, no. that's what you're happy. Okay. 
We are in the middle of handling the whole situation and then getting people out. And then, and then you and your son were, were, Carlos, I understand you guys are upset. We're telling you, hey, I'm trying to talk to you. Carlos, I'm trying to talk to you on the other side of that fence. I know, I know. And I saw him running, I, I went after him. As we That's did my too. kid, too. As we did, too. He's charging at some people, okay. probably assuming he that they not were involved. Take the, he should not take He didn't have a major weapon. And he had mental problems. And I'm his parent. When he was running, I was running after him, trying to calm him down. Right. This is how you guys kill people. He didn't have no guns. He didn't have no nothing wrong to be taped. Really? If that's your son, will you taste him for running be honest to me? If that's your son, you're going to taste him? He didn't have nothing, no ball, nothing on his hand. The 17-year-old expressed remorse multiple times to the officer who tased him. However, despite his apology, he was charged with several offenses, including disorderly conduct, disturbing the peace, and assault.